my brand new Christmas Ninja Foodie cookbook has just been released on pre-order. This video will give you a glimpse of the type of recipes that are going to be inside. You can pre-order your copy now at www.susannaskitchen.uk. This really is a showstopper. As you can see where I've turned them over, we've got a nice amount of colour on those. And now all we do is we just spoon this. So you can clearly see the two layers. Honey and mustard gammon. I am so, so pleased with this. Oh, so indulgent and yummy. Crab mac and cheese bubbling. It's crispy. It's got so much flavour in there. There you go. I've got my pattern of almonds over the top, which is going to look really pretty when that bakes. I cannot tell you how good this smells. We've got that slight hint of espresso in the background. We've got vanilla. We've got rich, rich chocolate. And then that Bailey's. Oh, this is heaven. I chose to decorate mine with some gold stars on the top. And let's just stir that all together. Now I can add in the whiskey. Look at those. Crispy, but really, really juicy. Here they are, ready to serve my little gorgeous prawns in blankets. Beautiful, smooth hot chocolate. Add in your favorite tipple. This hot chocolate is so, so good. It's absolutely delicious. I've given them a drizzle. Here they are, my gorgeous bruschettas made using the Ninja Foodie. There you go, lid down. We get these beautiful Yorkshire puddings. Salmon on croute. You can see those layers finished with the onions and the garlic, and then that beautiful flaky salmon and the cheesy sauce. It's gone really golden brown on top. So I'm just simply now pressing the crumb onto the borsin. Delicious, and we're going to make a beautiful sauce to dip these in. So each little piece of brie then sits on top of that. They are so crispy and beautiful. Look at that one. And it makes it a little bit more festive because we're going to be using some minced meat inside it. But we want the dish to be nice and full. And onto that, I'm going to be putting some mustard powder. Here's a close up of the pavlova topped fully. We've got those orange segments. We've got pistachios, we've got chocolate, mint. Now lower that rack over the top. Pork belly bites, which are absolutely perfect to serve at Christmas. So tender, but they've got that beautiful crispy fat on them, which we all really, really enjoy. That gorgeous sauce that we have made. Look at that. Absolutely delicious. And have a look inside. And my very last optional extra is some hot honey drizzled. Oh my goodness, over the top. Look how beautifully tender that lamb is. That is falling apart and that's exactly as we want it. I'm just slicing this up. Look how beautiful that chicken is. And these aren't going to be boring Brussels sprouts. I promise you that. You're going to absolutely love these. Anyone that doesn't like Brussels sprouts needs to try this recipe. When your stuffing is done, it's going to look like this. Beautiful little jewels of purple in the brine overnight. So I'm just going to unwrap that now. So give it a little bit of love. Give it some gorgeous flavour. Now, all we need to do is steam roast our turkey. We're cooking to temperature, we're not cooking to time. There we go, a full rack of stuffing. I just wanna show you inside one of these stuffing balls. So add in your blitzed up cashew nuts, and this is gonna add a real intense sort of creaminess 
to this curry. This is what they look like and you've got this space in the middle to put your filling. It smells absolutely divine. I hope you give them a go and don't forget to go and grab a copy of my brand new cookbook. You can pre-order your copy now at www.susannaskitchen.uk.